Greetings humans, the Spinning Man is here with the next episode of the Long Dark Challenge Mode Nomad. Thanks for joining me. Well, um, it is daytime, but it is actually not a whole lot of light coming out right now. So, we're going to work on this, but we're going to turn out our lantern. So we need another 7.2. Start with five. All right, we got two point two left. Boy, Okay, looking good. 2.2. Time to do 2.2. Alright, five hours daily left. Crafted new deer skin boots. Let us put them on. Very nice, very, very, very nice indeed. So I think that is going to be it for now, for the actual crafting of things. Well, I could check to see if we have enough to make like an arrow or something. I might, I might. So, we've got the shaft. Ugh, is it shaft? I guess we need feathers also though. of food. Okay. We'll break this down. Right, but again, the feathers. Fit. Boots don't fit. Let's take. Let's go in bed first. Stuff in the sixties. Okay. Do you have two feathers? Do you have two feathers? <laughs> Fine. Let's go make some arrows. three need three okay so that was that I guess we will do a round of equipment maintenance once then I don't know okay Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Could have spent some of a hacksaw. Alright, we're sharp, we're sharp. A bunch of stuff we're carrying around here that we don't need to be carrying around. So let's drop those on those. Those. Do we need? Anything else need fixing? Not really. I mean, the can opener eventually probably needs fixing. Meh. Meh. We'll do this. One more. we got metal box really does seem to be it concerning because you break down the hatchet hatchet except this Checked. So some dangerous, dangerous.
let's try to sleep eight hours through the night. Not tired. Okay. I'm not mad at that. Right, we're just gonna go make sure we're not missing our hacksaw. Just overlooking it. So the fuel. I thought and a whole can of fuel which I'm not seeing right now a jerry can weird Cured wolf pelts. Is that enough or do I need four? I would like to check that momentarily. We do, we got plenty of stuff. So I guess I could push them this way. That's okay. Let's take a peek. Clearly, we do not have a hacksaw. Need four. Dang. What to do, what to do, what to do? Don't have a hacksaw. And I need four wolf pelts to make a coat. Wish I had a hacksaw. What are we at? 2.7. Okay. It's pretty good. Pretty good indeed. We can move on to the next locale.
I mean, I don't know if it's worth it to just pointlessly break things up. We can just pass time and head on over to the camp office. So, kind of do want to take this maybe is everything from too here. Too heavy to carry. Yeah, it's real heavy. I'm gonna have to leave some of this. Okay. Let's go ahead and get rid of some stuff. Shall we? Stuff I just don't need. We want to keep all the food. How much from this? Don't we need that thing? Alright, what else can we ditch? So we don't need the second hunting rifle. No reason to carry two of those around. Seriously. And what else? Still haven't dropped enough stuff. Is dead left. All right, let's pick up what's on the floor over here. We're already at that sort of uncomfortable weight limit. I said we don't need any of that. Don't need metal. I think we're not going to bother picking up that wood. See the wood there. Wood. Books. And metal. What to put back. Hmm. <laughs> Quite a bit. We are going to want to put back quite a bit of stuff. So we are at 119, which is way too heavy. Give up one of those. Yeah, it's a tiny bit. Food again. I mean, I guess we don't need all the tea in China. Right, here's some extra unnecessary stuff. So many flares. Down to 115. Get 
this would be better if we were a bit lower. Yeah, 110. Good. Good, good, good. Torch. Don't need a torch. As long as I have a... There's going to be plenty of that stuff. So 108. We're moving along. Okay. Should be able to reset that speed a bit. But I really think that's all we need to be carrying over to the camp office. Which will be filled with plenty of goodies on its own. So we're at 2.7. So we want to do that. Two hours a day left. Four hours. No, no, no. I didn't want to sleep. Wish. We're at 2.8. Best time. <clears throat> something heavy. We had a good amount of water which lasted us, which is nice. Okay. Um, let's pass one more hour. Alright, let's see. Upper dam, lower dam, three of three. Pick it up. Let's head out. Let us head out. All right. Left behind a whole bunch of fire making stuff. A bunch of spares. Nothing too interesting. Smooth speed. Kind of have to be. Can't see the sky. It's too hazy. So I think uh, coming up in the next patch, what they're saying they're implementing is new textures for grass and rocks. So grass and rocks are going to look better. Obviously this grass is placeholder. I have called that out for a while, but it looked bad and clips the environment in all sorts of weird ways. There's all these little glitches. But they're improving that and the rocks 
They're adding like shorelines, coastlines, the ability to survive falling through the ice into the water, a wetness um, scale. Like if you do happen to fall through, you'll have to dry off before freezing because you're wet. Feathers? Really? All those birds are there. And no feathers. Hmm. Well, I'll be. Mmm. As soon as I'm done recording this, I'm gonna eat something. Yeah, eat something. I don't know what it's gonna be. Maybe a chocolate ice cream sandwich. Chocolate covered chocolate cookies with chocolate ice cream in the middle. Maybe. Maybe. What else do I got? We got big sourdough pretzels. Ooh. Got veggie chips. Mm. Ethiopian food for dinner tonight, and I took it easy and didn't eat a whole lot of it because I've been sick for a bit with um, digestive issues and Crohn's, etc. Um, so I didn't eat a ton of food at dinner. So I'm super hungry now. I'm always super hungry after baseball games. forestry look at was actually closer we are going to have to exit the zone so we'll probably do the uh, look out last as we exit the zone we'll do camp office first then trapper's cabin then forestry look out and back through the ravine, through the coastal highway, and then we'll wrap up the series and get our badge in Desolation Point. Kirkus Hervis. It's a Kirkus Hervis. On here sometimes. Don't need another one, but it's 
seems a bit strange. I don't know why I'm having trouble getting up this today. Okay. Really had to scoot you over there. Surprised. Fithers. I remember when they added footprints. There's like so much stuff they've added to this game. You don't even know if you haven't been playing for two years. So much stuff has changed and been added. But footprints was a was a good one. Blood trails. Graphics have been completely overhauled at least once before. All the textures. One thing they keep changing, like every major patch, they change the user interface, it seems. It changes a lot. Seemingly. Two hours. Closed and I was navigating completely by sound. So, what we're going to do is we're going to hop up here into the camp office and we are not going to loot it right now. I'm going to do that in the next episode. We just want to get all in here safe and sound. Go up and sleep till the morning and start ticking some of this time off the meter for the camp office. Still two hours, still two hours. Yeah, we are. Camp office. Yeah. The good old camp office. We will meander up the stander. Cause you know what? We're gonna be going to bed. BDQ. Two hours of daylight. What's our energy like?
114. Oh yeah, we're not tired at all. It's like, yikes. Alright, so let's, uh, two hours. Past time for three hours. Go ahead and do our thing. Let's do some cans. So we've got a good start on our camp office at point four. Hope you join me next time as we continue to check items off our funky scavenger hunt list here. Um, wait until next time to go loot to the camp office and afterwards we will hit up the trapper's cabin. Uh, if you enjoy these videos, it makes me super happy when you like and subscribe, and I hope you join me next time. That is going to be all for now. Spitting Mantis out. Namaste.